the slogan around here that lasted for an entire year was giving up is not an option. I had the opportunity to speak with Lane Chesney's teammates and they say that she was a fighter on the field as well as off the field and they are just so proud of her so it only makes sense for them to hold a memorial here at Pineapple Park. Now today the Wildcats softball team say that they lost one of their most valuable players 16 year old Lane Chesney. This morning her mother posted on Facebook that her angel Lane was called home today by our creator. Chesney fought to live for over a year in and out of hospitals after a terrible bonfire accident in 2000. 2017 left 90% of her body with third degree burns. Chesney's team members grateful for the time that they shared on the baseball field. They even shared a funny video with us and they say that she was a clown and she loved eating grapes. One of the tournaments she fit 14 grapes in her mouth. Seems unreal, like it couldn't actually happen. She was very energetic and always had a smile on her face. And she had like a weird sense of humor that was just hilarious. She, she was a very kind hearted person and just her presence literally would light up the room. Those girls, they appear very tough right there, but they shed a lot of tears in front of us. And they say that tonight they want anyone to come out to share any stories about their teammate here at Pineapple Park. And that memorial starts at 7 o'clock in Jensen Beach, Wakisha Bailey, WPBF 25 News.